In English language, a relative phrase is expressed by a word of or apostrophe s, like house of Zayd or Zayd's house. But in Arabic, this kind of expression is called murakkab idafi. It is to be written like this. Murakkab idafi. It is made by joining two nouns, like, I will make it, Baytu Zaydin, Baytu Zaydin, Zaydin. Now, Bayt is mudaf and Zayd is mudaf ilay. Mudaf and mudaf ilay. The first one is called Mudaf and the other one is called Mudaf Ile. As I just told you that Baytu Zaydin Baytu Zaydin in this Bayt is Mudaf and Zayd is Mudaf Ile. Now the other important point about Mudaf and Mudaf Ilay is that Al and Tanneen is never used on Mudaf. We can, net, we can never use Tanneen or Al on Mudaf. It can be used on Mudaf Ilay but not on Mudaf. The other important point about Mudaf is that it can be in all the Use, in all the three cases, it can be used marfu, mansub, or majroo. This can be, this can be baita, baito, and baitin. In all the three cases, it can be used, depending upon the construction in a sentence. The other important point about mudaf is that if we use dual noun tasniya in mudaf it will not be like ba ba ni then this noon is noon arabi and this will be drop this will be drop we will have to for example we have to say two doors of a mosque like ba ba al mas jide two doors of the mosque. The this known which is no which is called noon rabi is dropped. We can never use it. This is the correct form of making a mudaf mudafila. The other important point about this is that if you want to use uh, masculine plural like Muslimun Muslimun as Muzaf again this this noon which is called noon Arabi it will be dropped and if we have to say Indian Muslim then we have to say Muslimul Hin Muslimu Muslimu Al Hin That is Indian Muslim. This is an important point about Mudaf and Mudaf Ilay which should be remembered. The 
if you like the video you please share it and subscribe it and push the bell icon so that subsequent videos could reach you thank you very much